What did you do? We'll pull the trigger. Are you here to build? Or destroy? Keep your ears open. We're being tested. We are walking dead men. I'm not sure we're gonna make it. Learn from our past, predict our future. Educate your ex-president. FX is my ends. Vaughan Entertainment back here to break down episode 4, season 4. Trailers, we 42nd trailer, of course, the release at the end of the latest episode there. This one is called A Crow Flew By. I mean, we're going to assume that's to do with Sam Crow or the Suns in general, but more or less Sam Crow, of course. Um, it could just be a bird flying in the sky, but of course, every time they've did that, you know... Um, that's what's happened there, but as you can see, basically, the start of the promo is what happened at the end of the last episode, but, so as you can see, from this angle, Angel's right, like, this guy falls back, you know, I'm pretty sure, like, this is a different promo to what they showed at the end, well, it's practically the same, most of it's the same, right, but, and the other one, he's like, I didn't do it. Um, then we've got Easy, of course, confronting confronting him. Then we have Kanche at the table saying, like, who the fuck took the shot. Um, then it pans the <laughs> Angel looking at Easy. He's kind of like, yeah, buddy, it was me. So, not good. I mean, Santa Padre were kind of warned. I mean, it was kind of hinged on this whole uh, border crossing. <laughs> if it didn't go through... They were gonna get fucked, and it looks like they're probably gonna get fucked. But at the same time, like even if, even if like the other minds like Conche like buy that it wasn't them, it was some other guy, the cartel guy, a little snort, he made it clear that this had to fucking go through. I don't, like regardless, so I don't think it's gonna matter what the reasoning behind it. Of course, it will be a better reason that it wasn't actually Angel that did it, and it was like what Border Patrol or someone along those lines, but. Either way, man, not good, but Easy and Manny still forming this partnership. You can see them shaking hands there. We've got the president. Vice, is that the vice president of Yuma? Uh, I don't know who that is on the right. We've got Alvarez sitting down. Basically saying, oh, this is the future of the club. Then we get this. Basically a recap of her opening the barrel and finding the SOA patch. Then we basically get the San Bernardino VP on the phone to her. Keep your ears open. Like... And look at this, she's up against the gate, like, and we're supposed to believe that Alvarez is looking at her or something, right? But, like, how blatantly fucking obvious is she making that, that she's on the phone here? Like, and it just looks so dodgy, like, why would she be looking like this? It's not like she's on a stealth mission, all she did was leave, she's like, fuck it, I'm not coming, I'm not coming back here, like, to be a bartender, like, it's not like she fucking left on bad terms, like, where she killed five people and she can't be seen here. Retard, so it's like, San Bernardino have planted her as a, a watch, a rat, so to speak, a mole. We've got this bald guy getting out the, the back of a pickup truck, so you some rang with him. Hank sitting having a beer. Uh, Sons of Anarchy, dude getting in the front of that car. Basically get him telling him he's a dead man walking. We get these two talking in the car. We get Easy talking to Bishop. Easy then opens this Mayan book. Which shows it says Mayans, MC, California. Gonna assume this is the do Alvarez in his original chart. Now you see on the front cover, looks like Alvarez on the left. The guy on the right though, I don't know who the fuck that could be. Kind of looks like Easy if he was older. But that doesn't make no sense. Easy then Dex Bishop. And then basically tells the rest of the Santa Padre members that they need to educate their ex-president. Oh, that's what we like to see. And that's basically where the promo ends. So it looks like Sons are going to get involved next time out. And also, um, yeah, there's going to be some fallout for what happened at the end of the last episode, guys. But anyway, leave your thoughts down below. Until next time, peace.